Hey, what's up, YouTube? Welcome to my review of the Through Night TC20 Pro. That's this light right here. It's got a smooth reflector. It comes with a recharging cable, a lanyard, some spare O rings, a key ring, and this belt holster, which has a loop here, ring here, Velcro there. It does not come with this knife, but I am working on a review of this, and who knows? By the time I post this, that may be up. I get offered flashlights constantly. But these days, I only accept lights that I actually want to own. The max beam distance on this is well over 300 meters. I like lights that can basically crush the field test, meaning they can cross a soccer field or a football field with ease. This is a single battery light, but max lumens over 3000, right? That's pretty good, and because it uses a very high capacity battery, you can actually use this on high quite a lot uh, before you would have to recharge that. You know, this uses a 26650 size of battery. I've been into lights for a long time. A lot of lights now, new ones, are using uh, the 21700 size of battery. But the 26650 is still quite good to me because I have a stockpile of some very high quality 26650s. Like this, for example, this Keep Power, it's actually a very high quality 26650. So as a prepper, I want something that's compatible with a lot of the stuff I already have. And here are the stats on the light. So, max beam distance, 348 meters. And as you can see, the maximum turbo, 3,294 lumens. And you can see the run times for all those as well. You press this to turn it on. You press that to turn it off. Once it is on, if you press and hold, you can cycle through uh, three brightness levels, uh, low, medium, and high. All right, so that's the high mode. Now, if I double tap, it's going to go to turbo, and a double tap again will be strobe. So warning, there's going to be a little flashing. All right, that's turbo, kaboom, and that's strobe. You'll see that all better when we go outside. This also has Firefly, which is an ultra low mode. So from off, long press, and that is your Firefly. To access the battery, you can just unscrew the tail cap. Here is the 26650, uh, very high capacity. This is going to have incredible endurance. You can recharge this in a uh, separate battery charger or in the light itself. To recharge it, connect it to a USB power source, that is a power bank, using the cable provided. This has Type-C, rapid recharging. Now when it is recharging, there is a little red light right there, and when it is fully charged, that will glow blue. Okay, at this time I'm going to roll in some outside demonstration footage, and then we'll come back for final thoughts on this light. Okay YouTube, here is the light on the testing board, so that is the low. Let's go through. That's the high mode. Wow, that's the turbo. Gonna strobe, warning. That's the strobe. All right, back to turbo. Wow, so that's pretty bright. All right, one last mode, the firefly. Let's see if that shows up. All right, that's the firefly. All right, back to turbo. I'm on the bike tonight, getting a little exercise. This was kind of an emergency outing because uh, according to the internet, rain is predicted for every night next week, right? So had to get out here and test this light. And I've had this bike for years and it's more than paid for itself in terms of physical fitness. I got a light on my bike. That's my light. It's also a radio, so I can listen to tunes while I'm relaxing. Hold on, focus, yeah. Yeah, we got some vegetation all around. It's very, very humid today, so... A little bit of precipitation in the air. And here's a beam shot for you. Top view. Wow. That's nice. Get behind it, yeah, going all the way down the road. Okay, we're at Frog Creek. Boom. 
Wow. So the creek is definitely flowing strongly. Yeah. The waters of Frog Creek. May it never run dry. All the vegetation is overgrown. Opposite bank. Up to the treetops. Yeah, this light lights up everything. Yeah, you can see. This would make a nice thumbnail. Hope you're all doing well these days. Definitely. Yeah, it's like daytime. It's like daytime down there. You can see everything. We're out at the sports field. I'm standing in one goal. We're gonna see how this crosses the field. Let's go turbo. There we go. Wow, nice. Yeah, you see that. <laughs> nice. Yeah. This crushes the field test, I mean. Wow. Yeah, from the max beam distance, I knew that this would just dominate on the field test. All right, YouTube, we are back. So final thoughts. Should you get this light? Well, probably, I mean, it's relatively compact for how bright it is. You know, well over 3,000 lumens maximum. The max beam distance is well past 300 meters. I mean, it's got, it's got the uh, brightness, but the fact that it kicks it out that far is impressive to me. Uh, a lot of endurance, very high capacity battery. And convenient, you can recharge it in the light. Has a two amp rapid recharging current. The controls are intuitive. I checked the current pricing on this. It's going for about $65 right now. Well worth it, I mean, with the uh, battery included. I mean, yeah, this would be very good for preppers. Who doesn't need a flashlight, just basic you know, just basic backyard security. So yeah, very useful. I'm going to put this to good use. Definitely. Hope you enjoyed the video. Check out the links below the video for all kinds of cool stuff. This has been We All Juggle Knives and Flashlights. I'm out.